Right, so today's little venture, I've got to go and get my dad's blood pressure tablets for him, his prescription's ready. So what I want to do today, while I'm doing that little venture, is I've done the snorkel mod on the VFR, which this little pipe sits underneath the tank down there, and that's the air intake into the air box. Now a lot of people say that's like trying to breathe through a straw, so a lot of people have removed it. I'm not sure what difference it makes performance wise, but I know it's supposed to make the engine sound better. So what I've also done is my little camera here on the fairing, this one, on the back of it, there, is a microphone. So when I do my editing, I have to mute the audio off that camera because all you get to hear is wind noise. So what I've done, I've blocked up the rear microphone with a bit of Sugru. So now it's only re rely, it's only going to be using the front microphone. So I want to see if that picks up the sound of the engine. So let's go and try it while we get my dad's prescription. And already starting the bike up and giving it a few little revs. The engine sounds amazing. It sounds really, really good. So I'm hoping I pick it up on camera. Right then, let's see if that camera works or whether I have to mute it and whether we get a better sound from the engine. Oh, oh God, oh, it sounds sweet. Oh, my life. Well done. Oh, my God, I don't think it's going to make that much difference. It feels a bit smoother as well. Oh, I hope it's picking that sound up. Oh, that sounds delish. It sounds delish. So I'm hitting a bit of wind there. So I'm just hoping that this camera now the back microphone's blocked, that hopefully the front microphone is recording, but then again, I suppose with a bit of aerodynamic, the wind might curl round the front of the mic, uh, round the front of the camera and get into the mic, so we shall see. But that sounds amazing, that does. <laughs> you never know, it might be picking it up in my helmet mic as well. Oh, that does sound delicious. Right. Oh, even just pulling off. It sounds like a beast. Just seem to be a bit of difference. I wouldn't say so much in the performance, but it does feel smoother. So I think that extra bit of air it's sucking in must be doing something. Now the fuels are cheap. It'd be a shame not to fit up. Ready for next week's journey to work. Okay. Bike off. Let's go and get my dad's prescription. Oh, yeah. oh, I really do hope that has picked up the audio good. Right, that's
Let's start the prescription done. Time to head home. On my beautiful sounding beast. Amazing what that little snorkel does. I'd imagine its design was originally something to do with oxygen and the O2 sensor and the exhaust emissions. Something to do with some Euro regulations, I imagine. <laughs> oh, trust it to be a speed camera there. Oh, she does sound nice. Little Miss Perra. Right, watch outside there, temperature. 10 degrees. Temperature's coming up. We're not allowed out. Amazing. Need to clean my mirrors, I think. So there we go guys, I don't know if, obviously if you're watching this video, then I think there was a bit of an improvement, so I've made the video and edited it. If you're not watching it then, you're not going to know, only I'm going to know. When I know what I do have on my helmet, this shark helmet's got a very good uh, chin guard underneath. Well then if you can see it, so it stops a lot of wind entering the bottom of the helmet, so... Normally my microphone for my voice um, is quite good at stopping quite a lot of wind noise. But also that's obviously stopping the sound of the engine getting in as well. But I'm hoping this little um, camera here might have had some benefit today with that rear mic covered. I'm just unsure whether the, the front part is still going to pick up wind. I think it's going to slow down mate, yeah. It's time to get out. Till the next video. I'll see you all soon. Stay safe. I was going to say right safe, but we can't. Unless you are a key worker. And you travel to work on your motorcycle. If not, stay safe. And we look forward to that first ride out. Let's give it just a little toot. Ooh, and again. Oh, little, little bit of loveliness. So I'll tell you what, being housebound, but having to do these little journeys for me dad, every couple of days getting out, don't often make a big difference. One more. Ooh, We are in, we are home, we are back, we are safe. There we go, girl. Till the next one. Peace out, peeps. Three, two, one, go.